competitive, clutch, humble, and boomer sooner. Four characteristics that describe four-star quarterback and Oklahoma commit Spencer Rattler. After high school, I'll be continuing my athletic and academic career at the University of Oklahoma. Boomer sooner. New Wave 19. Let's get it. Spencer committed to Oklahoma his sophomore year. Now as a junior, he is the number one passer in Arizona and still manages to maintain a 4.0 GPA. Although Spencer receives the recognition for his accomplishments on the field, he credits his parents for all of his success. I contributed to my, my parents. Uh, they instilled hard work in me uh, at a young age. Uh, when I started training with Coach Giovondo, uh, like 10 years old, 11 years old, I started to get better and better from there. and. Uh, I just kept working on my craft since then. You know, it's really been easy and really been a lot easier since we recently committed to Oklahoma. That took a lot of the pressure out of it, in my uh, opinion. Spencer is a fierce competitor. He doesn't get rattled in clutch situations, and he wants the ball when his team needs him most. He always likes to take the toughest guy at basketball, even though he's not the starting point guard, um, per se. And then football, um, early on in first grade and up, he, he actually was quarterback and safety. Because he, he, with NYS, he kind of played both sides. So he enjoyed that part, too. Um, he still wishes he could receive a ball at times, but we're, we realized he was not uh, built for that, and we've enjoyed this ride so far. Mike Giovando is the creator of Elevate QB Academy and has been coaching players for 15 years, has coached Spencer for the last six years, and has coached players at all levels, including NFL quarterbacks Tyrod Taylor, Colin Kaepernick, and Tim Tebow. Spencer comes here every week to meet with Coach Giovando to boost his footwork and his passing skills. I met him in fifth or sixth grade, probably fifth grade, and he was good then. He was a you know, natural talent. But uh, you know, obviously you want to develop and take the time to work with somebody like that. When they have that natural ability, now you want to just make it to where it's just you know, something that other kids can't reach because they already have that God-given talent. And with that hard work and that dedication of coming in and learning the craft even you know, more on a regular basis and really diving into it, I think that's why you've seen him kind of develop into the, you know, the player that he has. Spencer has a bright future ahead of him, and it will be interesting to see how his career develops as he begins to plan for the next chapter of his life in Norman, Oklahoma. For Sports 360 AZ, I'm Austin Burnett.